Welcome back, this is Yama Jack. We got, you know what, we're not gonna do Gunslinger. We're gonna do Commando. I wanna do Commando, we're gonna do Commando. Look at that. See how easy it is? I decide I wanna do Commando, and then boom! Commando, we're doing Sanitarium. It's a scary map, but I'm in, uh, I'm in a better place mentally today than I was uh, in previous days. I think, I think I might even be able to handle Nightmare at this point. Maybe. We're not gonna try, <laughs> but I think I think mentally I'm in a place where I could, uh, I could handle it, you know? This is a scary map because you got the Cthulhu thing popping up on you, right? You got, you got Cthulhu up in the water. Thinking he's all that. And you got the, the rain and the wind and the, the scariness and it's just, uh, bad stuff all around. And that's terrifying. I have no idea what this does. No idea. There's two of them. There's another one over here. I think maybe you have to pull them at the same time or something. Or they turn on lights or something. I don't know. Like, maybe they turn on these things. To light up the Cthulhu. I do not know. I have no, no clue what, uh, what it is that they do. But I think they turn on the lights, right? Probably? I mean, that's, that's the only thing I'm noticing here. Alright, we're commando. We can extend. I'm like, why is this taking so- yeah, yeah, it turns on the light. And this one turns on... I can't even activate it yet, so maybe it's- maybe this that thing? I don't know. Look, it's, uh... There's- there isn't really any feedback, like, you don't- You don't even get, like, a k-kunk! Right? It's just... That's my sound effect of a lever. <laughs> Aww, pathetic. Pathetic. I think it's that. I think it's that one. Come on, bring it. Bloat. Yeah. Wow. Horrible showing. Horrible, horrible showing. Didn't even... No, I think we did get enough, actually. Like, we didn't even get enough for our uh, M203, but no, we did. Just not enough to buy it responsibly. <laughs> you know? <laughs> definitely, definitely. A better choice would have been. Oops. Better choice. <laughs> ah! I have no idea what's happening to me right now, but it's uh, it's good stuff. So, last night, my uh, my sister made uh, some cocktails for us. I don't, I don't drink that much. Like, really at all. Um, but since, since quarantine's happened, for some reason I've been drinking a lot more. Not, uh, not getting drunk or anything like that. You know, I'm, I'm a, I'm a responsible adult, you know, but, um, definitely have been drinking way more since quarantine happened. My sister's just been buying more booze for us, so, and, and again, we're, we're responsible drinkers. Like, we, we don't, I haven't actually been drunk in, like, I don't know, a year. Um, but, uh, we, uh, she made, she made these cocktails last night with this, like, uh, it was a lemonade, vodka, and then this, like, blue liqueur, and she definitely did not measure them right, because, <laughs> yeah, it was, it called for, like, five ounces of lemonade, um, an ounce of vodka, and then an ounce of this blue liqueur. So you would, and they were both full bottles, the the liqueur and the uh, the uh, the vodka. They were both they were both full, right? And so 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 you would expect that when you're done making, you know, the the three of these that uh, that she made for for my mother, myself, and her, you would expect that when you're done, you would have lost the same amount of the blue liqueur. And the same amount of the the vodka, right? Like there would have been an equal amount missing of both of them because they both take an ounce. So when you make three of them, you would be down three ounces of the blue liqueur and three ounces of vodka, right? That's just that's just math. That's how it works, right? It's very simple. Well, that, that didn't work out that way. So we ended up with like basically no vodka, and then uh, the blue liqueur was like half empty. <laughs> so. 
It was uh, it was a lot more alcohol than uh, than I think either of us really were expecting from the from the cocktail. But it was still it was a it was a very tasty cocktail anyway. Um, but it was it was it was it was good fun because I was planning on having uh, like a couple of ginger beers last night as well, and after I drank this, I'm like, yeah, no. <laughs> Uh, I think I'm. Yeah, we got Cthulhu popping up. I've never seen Cthulhu pop up. I want to watch Cthulhu pop up. We're gonna die because I decided to watch Cthulhu pop up. And I didn't even get to see it. I wanted to watch Cthulhu pop up, and I didn't even get to see it. And I hope he doesn't pop up above this bush. Oh my! God. <laughs> uh, I don't even get to see it, and then when I die, I'm not even in a place where I get to see it when he's dead. It's just completely pointless. Oh, boy. We're never again. Yeah. Good water. Hey. What was I even talking about? Ah, yeah, yeah, yeah. So I was planning on having some, uh, some ginger beers last night as well. And I had this, I had this Blue Lagoon thing or whatever. I don't even know what it's called. And I'm like, you know what? I think I've had enough. Uh, I think I've had enough booze for for one day. So I like I like being like tipsy at best. You know, I don't I don't like being past that. I'm a lightweight as he all heck. Like when I drink, I, I don't. It, it doesn't take much to to get me to the tipsy point. It's it's very little. Perhaps placebo, but uh, placebo or otherwise, it does not take much for me to start feeling it. And then I don't really like going past that point. Not too often, anyway. Because once you go past that point, you're committed, right? You want? I want to be doing something at that point. I want to be like with some people, having a blast or whatever, right? I don't want to be just by myself, basically, and uh, completely wasted. That's that's no fun. And also just like not healthy. But I've got a got a couple of ginger beers left in uh in the fridge for whenever I decide I want those. Maybe tonight. Probably not tonight though. I, know, I, had, I had booze last night. I don't want booze again today, you know? That's oh, too much booze. A drink every day is, is too many drinks. I always talk to uh, to, to uh, in the server when uh, that I'm in when I uh, when I'm drinking because I don't know I, I talk about what I'm doing right if I'm doing something and, and I'm enjoying it, I'm probably gonna you know talk about it. And that's kind of how talking works, right? You want to you want to talk about the things that you're doing, having fun doing and whatnot. Um, but every time I'm drinking, they're always like, be responsible. I'm like, you know, come on. I, I, in their defense, I, I did get pretty wasted in the, in the server once and, uh, make a bit of a fool of myself. But that only happened once. I've drank a lot of times other than that and, uh, you know, not made a fool of myself. I was kind of... Turn the, the lighthouse on. No, the lighthouse is already on, so I have no idea what it does. Cool beans. Okay, you just phase through the floor. That's cool. So much for Gibbs. So yeah, it always feels a little bit. Um, I don't know what the word for. Like the feeling of being hurt without actually like it hurting is, because I'm pretty sure there's a word for that, right? Like when they uh, feel, I feel, I feel, because uh, I don't actually like I'm not actually hurt by it, but it gives me that feeling of like it's like the most minor feeling of uh, inadequacy that you can have. Like, do you guys really think that little of me? But I'm gonna I'm gonna get drunk every time I, I have a, a have a beer or something. 
But then I'm also like, they obviously don't, so I'm not like upset about it. And I'm like, I don't want to like. There's always like things, right? When you when you're talking about something with somebody and they're like, so I was uh, what was it? It happened the other day. It happened the other day. Um, I'm trying to I'm trying to think of what it was. Actually. Come on, come on. I know I, I was talking in Discord, so I'm trying to look up the, the messages that I sent. But I can't I can't find them. I can't find them. Anyway, I was talking about something and I said uh it's probably harder. Oh yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. So uh, a friend's name. He has uh, a name that's not hard to pronounce, but isn't as it's you would you would think it is pronounced when you when you read the spelling of it. I'm not gonna say his name for privacy reasons, but his name is uh, is not pronounced exactly as it's spelled. At least not if you're a, a primarily like English speaker. Um, so somebody was like, how, well, how hard can it be to pronounce your name? And I'm like, probably harder than you think, but easier than I'm making it sound. Because, like, it's, it's only like that, that slight bit of difficulty. And this kind of stuff happens all the time. Where I'm like, yeah, so it's bigger than nothing. But even me just saying that is probably going to make you think that it's bigger than it is. You know what I mean? Like... I wish there was a was was some kind of a, a word for the the least possible like difficulty or challenge or hard or or, or something like that because um, that's that's what it kind of makes me feel when when these people are always like oh uh, you know make sure you're being responsible or whatever it's like it, it's the least possible inadequate feeling that I could have. Right, it, it doesn't actually bother me. I'm just um, talking about it for the sake of talking about it. But even me just talking about it probably makes it sound like more than it is, right? Because it doesn't bother me at all. But I don't know. It's uh, I wish there was a word for that. Oh, I was talking in, uh, in a not recent episode, but about um, the the armor that bugs have. The uh, Titan. I was talking about that in, a, in an episode, and I said that I would uh, I would know it for the next episode, and then I, I didn't actually tell you guys in the next episode. But Chitin is, I did actually look it up, and then I just I didn't tell you. But uh, Chitin is in fact the uh, like a part of the exoskeleton of um, it's like what makes up the exoskeleton of uh, of things that have exoskeletons, basically. So I was right. I was right when I said that. It's a forever ago episode, so uh, if you don't remember it, then fake fan. <laughs> no, it was a. I don't even remember what episode it was. It was in like pre hundred, I think, like ninety or eighty or something like that. I don't know. They all kind of blend together at this point. When you have so many episodes, when you're as big of a YouTuber as I am, you know. <laughs> no, when you uh, when you have as many episodes as I have up, you, you can't remember. What is I got this uh, this one viewer who I uh, I chat with all the time. Wonderful lad, but he he'll he'll always he won't comment on the video, right? Never never comments on the video. He's a bit of a jerk like that, but <laughs> he'll message me privately, and oh don't have the money for that. He'll message me me privately in uh, or not privately, but just not on the video. Um, and he'll he'll comment with something on the video like uh, I was talking in, uh, in a last one of last week's episodes about um, we can't get like sucked but this isn't a bad place to be so we'll try it. I was talking, I was talking in a recent episode about my um, my naps and how I'm napping now and it makes me feel so much better. And he was like, "Oh my, oh my god, oh dear, oh dear, oh dear." I, uh, I don't like this so much. 
Oh dear. Just that was that was a great start to the round there. Put my naps and stuff, and uh, he'll just message me like, um, "Just fix your sleep schedule, SMH." I'm like, okay, this is this is definitely in reference to one of the videos that I recorded, but what video and what was I even saying? Because I cannot, for the life of me, remember it. Because you just, it's just. Yeah, yeah, I record 14 episodes a week. I mean, there's so many topics that go into these videos. And, uh... I'm sure I repeat myself often, but... Again, like, that's kind of the thing. I can't remember every topic that I've talked about. There's, I don't know, 152 at the time of the recording, plus all the ones from this week. I mean, it's, it's, a, it's a whole lot of, of videos. It's hard to remember every single topic that I've ever talked about. I've never been over... Like, past here. Let's see what's down here. Just for funsies. Is it a good idea to see what's down here? Absolutely not. This is probably one of the dumbest ideas I could have ever had, but it worked out okay, I think. Thus far. Oh, is this gonna take us to that, like, weird... Oh, it takes us here? Really? Neat. Neato. The esoteric order, but somebody says cult. Somebody is very against the esoteric order of whatever it is because I didn't get to read the rest of it because I got kind of uh, distracted by the whole cult part. I hear a scrake. Yeah, I hear a scrake. I heard a scrake. Look at that. Look at that hearing ability of me. I think there's like a, a spot where you can kind of go into like a... Uh, supernatural place. Is it up here? Yeah, 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 yeah. This feels, this feels right-ish. It doesn't anymore, but it, it did for a bit. Where's my, where's my supernatural place? Ooh, hello. And where's all the the baddies? Not you. The other baddies. So anyway, the, the moral of the story is I'm calling out this viewer of mine for, uh, for A, not commenting on my videos, and B, uh, we're just gonna, we're just gonna explode you. Do these guys, like, grab me and stuff? Nah. That would've been cool, though, right? And B, making me have to remember all of the topics I've talked about in all the videos. Because he won't, he won't even tell me. He'll just, he'll, he'll talk about a thing and then not even tell me what he's talking about. I'm like, well, I don't know what you want me to say because I really have no idea what you're talking about. Anyway, I, uh, I do kind of like this map now. Outside of when these stupid tentacles can just scare the ever-living bejeebus out of you. That's super duper not fun. This guy kind of looked like he had weird tentacle feet for a moment there. It, it kind of, I was kind of very confused about what was happening to him. Where you at, buddy? Where you at? This isn't you, but uh, you're going to die. Oh, I hear him. I'm not sure where I hear him. I'm going to turn this on in case it's like a trap up there or something. I don't know. Hello? You what? You just get to hit me like that? That's not... That's not cool, bro. That ain't cool, bro. Hit me here, please. Hit me... Here, please. Thank you. Now I put some distance. And grenade to the face! And another grenade to the face. Except uh, this time we're gonna yeah, ow. get hurt a little bit better. I'm hoping that uh, I was I was kind of hoping that the uh, the grenades on the the king flesh pound would have taken out the uh, the quarter flesh pound, but so much for that, eh? Oh, you juked it! You juked it! You absolute legend!
You're gonna laser me? Yeah, you're gonna laser me. I saw that laser coming a mile away. You can't fool me. Think you can fool me? You can't fool me. <laughs> That's what you get. I don't see this guy's... Okay, it was just uh, not showing up for some reason. That's cool. I can accept that. I mean, I can't. I'm very offended. Deeply offended. I'm hurt. Are we gonna be able to make this without having to actually like shoot him? Just with these, uh, just with these grenades? Because we're getting all these ammo boxes as we kind of run around here, so I think we might be able to make it. You gotta, you gotta get hit every now and then to, to put some distance between you. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. No, this is totally gonna do it. Right there. Look at that. Excuse me. Excuse me. Oh, I guess you got like field medic XP for killing him because I dealt a little bit of damage, but. Okay. <laughs> sure. <laughs> whatever you whatever you say. Like I'm level 25 commander. Why am I leveling up? Oh, it's field medic. Why am I getting field medic XP? But I did do the uh, the one shot. That was a very easy King Flash Pound fight. <laughs> My goodness. Oh, you got like a billion different XP there. No, it's got every uh, almost every perk. That's going to do it for today. Thank you for watching. Remember to like, if you like, and subscribe to see more in the future. Comment if you have anything to say, and I will see you next time. Do comment. Don't message me. Just, just comment on the video. Bye-bye. <laughs> see you next time.